Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in this video, I'm gonna be unboxing my Illumicrate May box here. Um, yeah, um, I haven't been that excited for Fairy Loser or Illumicrate lately, just because their items are very haven't been that great for me. So I don't know how much longer I'm gonna keep the items in book box before I switch to book only. But yeah, anyways, here is the box for the month of May. And the theme for this month was What Lies Beneath. Um, so yeah, that's the theme. And then next month's theme is Night and Day. So yeah. So the first item here that I'm seeing is this box right here, which is a cool looking box. I think the box is pretty cool. And it says the Halfway Plant Pot. So yeah, let's go ahead and open it. Um, I don't know about plant pots, to be honest. I don't have any real plants in my room, so. But here is the plant pot. I will say it is very, very beautiful, and I do love this plant pot. So I might actually find a plant to put inside here or something. But yeah, this is really, really nice. I do like it quite a bit. Um, let's see what it's inspired by. It is inspired by House of Hollow, uh, which I did read, and I didn't like it. I know a lot of people did like it. I just wasn't one of those people that did. So, yeah. <laughs> Anyways, the next item we have here is a metal bookmark inspired by Witch King by Martha Wells, which is actually the um, this month's book uh, for this month. So, yeah. I love metal bookmarks. They're my favorite thing to receive in book boxes. Um, so, here it is. Um, it looks really, really cool. Um, hopefully you guys can see it there, but look how cool this looks. I love it. I really love it. And then I have like a hanging heart on the bookmark. So yeah, I'm very, very happy with this metal bookmark. I love metal bookmarks and I'm always happy when they are included in these boxes. So I'm very happy with that. All right. The next thing we have here is this, which... They included an item like this a few months ago. Um, Fairy Loot, Illumicrate, they love repeating items that you really don't need so many of, to be honest. Especially the storage organizer, because even for Fairy Loot, we also got something like this, but it's a little different. But anyways, here is the design for this month. It says, wishes are false, hope is true, hope makes it makes its own magic. And the same quote on both sides there. There's some teeth on there, which is, I think is pretty cool. Um, yeah, and then like, it's supposed to like put some books in here and like fold it out this way or something. Cause there is a inside design. If I get it on right, kind of like, see? So there's that. Um, I'm probably gonna give this to someone else cause I don't really need it, have a need for it. But I guess it's pretty cool. I know people will enjoy it. And then I think uh, there's one more item here, which is very small, so I almost missed it. But it's a pop socket here. And I like it. I like this, but it's kind of hard to see the design since it's black on black. So I kind of wish they didn't do that, but it's cool, I guess. Um, it's just a moth on here that says... Um, he was a paper moth in the dark and she was a light. So, yeah. Um, I think it's pretty cool. Um, I do like it, but I don't use pop sockets really. Um, but, yeah. And this is inspired by The Whispering Dark. So, yeah. And then the, um, the book organizer thing that I showed you was inspired by some Daughter of Smoke and Bone by Lenny Taylor. Okay. And, yeah, that's everything besides the book here so i feel like this was a very short video very fast but let me go ahead and take off the shrink wrap of this book right here i i know a lot of people were very excited for this book because she has a very famous like series the murder box series i think it is i don't know i'm not really interested in that series um so i don't know how i feel about this book either but it is the witch king uh, by Martha Wells. I do like the cover. I think the cover is pretty nice. And then we have the spine there and then the back. The top and bottom 
bottom are purple sprayed edges and then we have the edges there which are just purple stencil edges which I do like they're pretty simple pattern design but I do like them though I feel like it, the purple really doesn't match this butt cover maybe the one with like blue or something but I mean I do like it overall so I'm gonna go ahead and take off the dust jacket there's nothing on the reversible side of that so we have some nice gold falling on the front butt cover there um, it says, I know who you are, the demon, the mortals call king of the witches, do you promise revenge? I actually really like that quote, and I love the gold falling on this cover. I think it's very, very, very pretty. And then we have the spine there, and then there's nothing on the back. Um, so yeah. So we have some inch in papers here, which are very, very pretty. I do like them quite a bit. And then on the back, they're actually different, which is very, very nice. Because I know Lumicrate, they like to do the same, like, in paper, so to see that it's different is very, very nice. Um, it is signed by the author here. Um, kind of hard to see, but it's, like, very, very tiny. Um, but I saw a post from someone um, talking about her signature and why is it, like, just that. I'm not sure why, but, I mean, it really doesn't really matter. But, and it also comes with a author letter inside the book, which is very nice. So yeah, that is The Witch King by Martha Wells. This is the Illuminate May box. Um, overall, this box is just fine, I guess. Um, the book is very pretty. I do like the book quite a bit. I like the in papers. I do like the edges. The edges are nice. The cover is nice, I guess. It's just the original cover, I'm pretty sure. There might be some slightly color changes or something, but I do like it. Um, I really like the edges. I like stencil edges. They're very, very pretty. Um, the end papers are my favorite part, and I do like the gold falling as well, so I mean, overall, I'm pretty happy with the book. Item-wise, um, my favorite item is the metal bookmark, because I do enjoy those. The book organizer is fine. Don't really have a need for it. I'm going to give that away. Uh, the book plant, I do love. I love the design on it, um, and I'm going to either put a plant in there or just put some random shit in it. <laughs> the pop socket is very, very pretty, but I do wish it was not black on black. Um, but yeah, overall, that's it. Let me know your thoughts on the book and on the items. Um, overall, I'm just, I guess I'm happy with it. Um, so yeah. <laughs> anyway, make sure to like, comment below, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next unboxing. Bye guys.